It was weird to me at first to think that I might know something that doctors didn't. This Case Western biomedical engineering student is devoting his life to helping others. And as News 5's Homer Baz shows us, he's starting at home. It's such a rare disease uh, that, that there's really no cure for it. 22 years ago, right after he was born, Turner Montgomery's mom got sick. She was originally diagnosed by doctors with a disease called dermatomyositis, which is an autoimmune disease where her immune system is attacking her muscles and her skin. She lost weight, grew weaker, but it was an illness that she never openly shared with her three kids. I don't talk about it very much even to this day. For 15 years of my life, I had no idea that she had a disease that binds most people to a wheelchair by the time they're 40 years old. When Turner found out as a teenager, it changed the course of his life and determined his future career. The 22-year-old will soon graduate with a biomedical engineering degree from Case Western Reserve University. Using his time here and the tools at his fingertips to discover that his mom's diagnosis from more than two decades ago it wasn't the right one. It was weird to me at first to think that I might know something that doctors didn't, but I also know that I'm her son and no one was gonna spend as much time on her case as I was. He is the type who will never stop searching for answers. Doctors had been treating Debbie Montgomery for an autoimmune disease. With help from experts at Case and Johns Hopkins, Turner learned she actually has a type of muscular dystrophy. Then. He took that knowledge one step further. I built what is called an EMG. It measures the uh, voltage that's sent from the brain to the muscles. It's a small device still in the working stages, but proves progress to Turner's mom as she undergoes physical therapy. The only way to treat the disease they now know she has. I'm obviously a very proud mom. I am proud to say that I'm a mama's boy. Biomedical engineering students often say the main reason they chose the major is to help other people. For Turner, there is no better place to start than at home. So Turner hopes to use his project not just to help his mom, but eventually to help others. And the place where he came up with the idea and designed the device, it's called the Think Box at Case. It is the largest innovation center open to the public in the entire world. Reporting in Cleveland, Homa Bash, News 5.